What's going on guys, Bow here back with some MGG PvP, so let's get into this, see what we can uh, get done today. I did get silver in the last one, kind of forgot to get gold, but um, we'll see how far we can get in this one. And the meeting they're giving out is, I guess okay, I don't know, they haven't given out that one in a while. So I guess I can understand that, but they did give it out before, so I already have it, and I already have it gold as well. Um, I think I just need to level it up. I did get my Evo to level 39 as you can see, so I do have to get a lot of mutants leveled still. I am still leveling a bunch of them as well, but let's see, 72, so... People are not that high yet. It just started a few days ago. I'm gonna see if I can actually get the gold in this one. And um, also get to level 40 with my Evo. I should be able to get there pretty soon. I just leveled mine to 38. I have about 5 million uh, credits left over now. And uh, it's gonna take 48 or 40, 48 point something. I forgot how much exactly. It's so like 49 million. We'll say 49 million to actually get it up to level 40. So it shouldn't take too long. But we'll see how many of these guys we can get leveled. And I kind of messed up on this one. Oh, uh, we'll just attack him again. But it does look like we we're gonna win it, so. Alright, another one done. So we got two so far. 120. I believe he's one... I believe he's level 40 Evo. Alright, we're gonna use my team. Of course they're level 39 already. They're not max. Uh, my tag is gonna be changing. Um, yeah, this guy's level 40 Evo. I don't know if we're gonna be able to win. He's got two fast ones plus the behemoth. We're gonna want to take out the behemoth first. And my bat survived, thank god. Which is going to give us an extra hit in, so... And that extra hit did help. So there we go, we took down Behemoth, although they're going to take down my bats and put some damage into my other mutants. But... We are almost going to get their bat down, so... Ooh, we barely survived that one. Um, we're going to want to take down the bat, of course. Alright, let's see what happens. He is a higher level, he is going to do more damage. Nope, he's not going to do more damage. Guess he doesn't have a skill. Yeah, that is true, he's... Uh... Cyber Galactic, so... We actually won that one. If he would have actually took down my bat in that first one, I think I would have lost that one. Because I wouldn't got the, I wouldn't have killed the Behemoth. And I would have had to waste an attack on it, so yeah, I think I would have lost that one. So we got lucky there. We are going to use my team again. Level 120, as you can see. So they are level 40. I'm facing people at level 40 evos. Uh, mine should be there pretty soon, I hope. Um, I'm getting a little bit more, a little bit less credits right now, just because I'm leveling mutants. So when I'm leveling mutants, I level on a lower stage so I don't have to keep healing my mutants and stuff like that. I save all my healing for PvP. I save all my med packs for this. So... Getting a little bit of... a little bit less credits, but that's fine. We're gonna lose this one. See what happened there. They actually took down my stronger one first. Um, if you would actually attack Bat like last time or the bot, then maybe I would have won, but they are level 40 so they're gonna be doing a little bit more damage than than I am, but uh, hopefully I can get to 40 soon. And that crit and thing, that doesn't help. I feel like I always have that up, but I always notice they always get crits and stuff like that. Even people that don't have those, I, like most of the times they will hit a crit or something. 
And if you're wondering how I always keep it up, uh, slots, I do a lot of slots. I don't know if you noticed, but I do spend quite a bit of gold in the slots, and you get a bunch of them if you do. Although the ones that they give out now are only worth a day, but those add up if you're getting like three or four of them at a time. Um, we're actually going to take it out so it doesn't do any damage, because if we actually left them alive, then they would have both did damage, so it's better just to take them down. There we go, another one down. Doing good so far. But my tag is going to be changing since I did get to level 39. I'm not too sure what it was before, but I'm pretty sure it's been changing quite a bit. Let's get these guys to 40, and there we go. Yeah, we're going to get these guys to 40, probably maybe a week, I'm hoping. I don't know how long it's going to actually take to get uh, that much. I usually get about a million, two million per day, maybe a little bit more, maybe a little bit less, depending. But uh, if I level quite a bit, for each level you get 200k, so I could get a lot of credits out of it. If I leveled a lot, and I do got a bunch of new mutants that are gold that I still need to level. It's taking forever to do all that. And here's another win. Alright, let's go to the next one. Level 83. Oh my god, that's like level 50. Evo, something like that. So I'm going to lose that one, of course, and it's going to cost me 54,000 to change it. So we're just going to put on some shitty mutants and a shitty tag, because I don't want to waste any more med packs or a tag to actually try to beat this guy, because of course he has all three fast mutants, and they're just going to destroy whatever I throw up, even though I am a pretty high level. He's got about 9 or 10 levels on me, so... Did that guy just say it was level 80... 89? How the hell is he 89 and have... I don't know if I read that right or if that was him, but it said level 89. I don't know if he has that high of an evil, but uh... I don't know, I have to go back and check that. Alright, ooh, let's see... Um, we're gonna want to take down either of the faster ones. So we're gonna take down this one. It doesn't really matter which one we took down, because they're both gonna take a decent amount of damage from either one. Uh, let's see. And there goes the bat. Of course we're gonna use our stronger one, even though he, he's gonna hit a lot harder than what I need. Of course we're gonna take down the stronger one. Looking good so far. Yeah, we got this. There's no way he's going to be able to win. So there's another win right there. Barely getting any experience on that one. Yeah, we're barely getting experience, although it does take quite a bit. Alright, level 110. Of course, we're going to have to heal again. Gonna have to start making some more med packs soon. Most of the ones I have now I've already had for like ever. Because I have like seven med stations or something like that. So if you're wondering how I have so many, you just make med stations. You have seven of them and you do, depending on which one you do, you can make up to 70 or 140 med packs. Uh, was it every two hours or every four? I don't know, I would have to go look, but yeah, you can make quite a bit within a short amount of time. Make a couple thousand within like a couple days, so it's not that hard to do, especially if you have like 10 of them going at once. But I only have 7 at this right now because I don't really need any more than that and I haven't used them for a long time. I don't want to sell them just for the fact that uh, they cost 250 I believe 200, 200 or 250 
uh, gold, so it'd be a waste, and selling them only gives you credits, so... And this person has Tinker Blade, actually a pretty good mutant for a defense team. Because it does have quite a bit of life, and it's pretty fast, but it doesn't have that much attack, that's the only downside, so I'd use it as one of my other mutants. I would have switched out either Kong, yeah I would have switched out Kong over here in the closest one to us. I would have switched him out for a faster one. That would have been a little bit better setup. Having two tanks doesn't really do much, especially if uh, you're getting attacked like that, so... I want to have a faster one, at least one mutant in there should be 11.11. .11. Doesn't matter which one, there are a few out there now. Before it was only the bat, but now there's like five or six that you can have, so at least throw one of those on in your defense team. I mean, you can use all tanks, but most of the time those just get utterly destroyed unless you're like 10 levels ahead of the person or something like that. Maybe in a little bit less, but I would not use that defense team. Right now the defense team I'm using is the same one I'm I have on, but of course that's going to change. If you see me in the thing, I'm just going to leave it like that for a few days, but uh, I usually change it every every day or every other day, so... But for now, it's so early in the event, I really don't care if I get attacked. So I'm going to get attacked anyway, and if you can beat me, my evil's only level 39, that's fine. Alright, 11 attacks down, 40 more to go. Well, 39 more to go, but I want to get to that 50. I doubt we'll be gold by then, but we'll see if we can get there in time. Still got, uh, what, 11 days? So. And we're going to win this one as well. There's really nothing to do at this point. Done. Uh, we're still leveling. We're starting. We're almost to our max. Let's see. We're gonna use our same team. I'm not too sure what he's gonna have. He does have full circle. It's got the battle toad. See, I would have a setup kind of like that. Um, Mr. Marvelous, I would change up for anybody else, but that's a pretty good mutant to have as a defense team as well. It's got kind of a fast, medium, tankier type. Let's see, we're gonna want to take out either the faster one, although the faster one isn't gonna hit as hard as Marvelous, so I think I'm gonna go for him. Plus he's got more health, so hopefully my tag's actually good enough to take him down, because if not, I'm gonna have to waste another attack on him with the bot. And we actually got a good enough tag to take him down. Now all we gotta worry about is this guy in the middle. Uh, we're gonna leave... Nah, we're just gonna take him down, never mind. I was gonna leave the dude alive, but... Might as well take him down instead of getting attacked twice by him. Nope, we're gonna lose. Bad choice, bad choice. No, we actually survived with 600, never mind. Yeah, we almost lost there, actually. One more level and I can do just fine in this. Alright, he's 123, so he's got two levels on me. Let's see what happens. He's probably gonna win, most likely. He's got a fast. He's got the doll. I really don't like the doll. The doll's not that great of a... Well, I guess it's alright for defense. Might as well just take it down and get it out of the way, because then we're just gonna leave the... Should we leave the trooper? I don't think we should leave the trooper. We can take it down before it attacks the second time. Although the other guy's gonna get an attack, it doesn't really matter. Because then at that point it's gonna be two on one. And he's pretty much slow, so... Let's 
Alright, and we can get a free attack there. He's gonna go for the bot. So we got the bat left, and pretty much if the bat was the only thing left, I think we would have lost. But we do have two, so. There's another win there. We're actually doing pretty good in this one. 14 attacks down, 111 top 2%. The only reason I'm not silver right now is I don't have enough attacks. I need 30. And this person's the, probably the same level as me, just forgot to... Or no, he's probably one level higher than me, because he's got 119 on. One of his mutants isn't level 40 yet. And it does take a while to level some of these mutants. So let's go with... I guess we're gonna go with this one. Doesn't really matter, because they're both gonna get to attack. Um, plus the bat I can take down pretty easy. Alright, we're gonna put the extra attack into the, the middle one, and then the bat's gonna go down. Alright, let's see what happens here. He's probably gonna take down either the bot or something like that. Nope, took down the bat, never mind. But it doesn't really matter. Alright, another one down. And we're almost actually to my max, and we did get the mutant. 15 attacks in, we need 15 more to actually get the silver, which we would actually be at. Um, it's probably going to take me a while to get to gold, depending on how high these guys are. But I'm not too worried about getting gold right away. And, ooh, he's got, uh, I hate the tank, that tank right there. He's a really good tank, I would recommend using him. Or one of the other ones from that pack that they sold a while back. Let's see. Well, for my team anyway. Like, I feel I would've actually set up for... his team, I could've probably took him down pretty easy, but... We're gonna leave the bat... No, we're just gonna take the bat down, never mind. I was gonna say we're gonna leave the bat, but... I think if I take it down now... We'll see who he takes down here. And because I don't have anybody on my team that can uh, do that much damage to necro monsters, so but we still won that. So sixteen attacks down, and some of levels fourteen. So I'm actually one level ahead of him. So he's got a level thirty-eight one. Ooh, let's see. We're gonna want to take down either of the fast ones. Uh, I'm thinking more of the middle one, because the bat I know I can almost one-shot. And he got a shitty tag there, so if he would have got a better tag, we would have actually probably been in trouble. But... Let's take down this bat, and we barely missed it by a thousand, but that's fine. Because we should be able to win right here. Because it's 2v1, either it's going to take down the bat or the other one. And we're going to have one left, so at that point it's going to be over. Oh, he actually didn't take down the bat. But it wouldn't have mattered because I would have gotten two attacks either way, so... But that's going to be about it for this one. We did get 17 in and we will try to get to the 30 on the next one. But thank you for watching, hope you enjoyed, and we'll talk to you next time.